let's talk about how to prepare a query in the expected result see there is a question actually where i have two columns with raw data in my employee table where i have employee id employee and employee name but employee name has employee name at the rate company.com in the result set i need to split the the employee name into a two columns where employee name is nothing but the name which is available before at the rate that is nothing but employee name company name is nothing but the name which is available between at the rate and dot is nothing but a company name here so if you see here google it is after at the rate and before dot com similarly microsoft at the rate after and before dot similarly boa and xyz so i need to prepare a query to get the result like this let me quickly show you the query the raw data which i prepared for my example if you see this id employee employee name um employee email actually this one john at the rate google.com direct at the rate microsoft.com head at boa raj at the rate xyz here in this example i am going to use care index so where i need to identify the at the rate because employee name is nothing but before at the rate symbol so i need to identify the care index first based on the care index only i can generate the employee name similarly i can generate the company name as well depending on the care index of at the rate and dot so here i will be using substring as well now also one more function i will be using left so left of email comma care index position of at the rate minus 1 is nothing but employee name substring of email means what what is the main string which you need to use to get the data email comma what is the starting position of the company is care index of at the rate plus 1 comma care index of dot minus care index of at the rate because uh, the company name is nothing but in between dot and at the rate minus 1 as a company name so this is the query which gives you the expected output so id employee employee name and company name so here if you understand clearly i'll be splitting the raw data this is source table is nothing but raw data i'm converting the raw data into a meaningful format where i can use this meaningful data in any of the reporting platform